Zachary, may I may I share with the class what you just texted me, <laughs> please? Oh. oh yeah, yeah. Go ahead. I, I I didn't know if you wanted me to interrupt the game with that, but no, uh... no. I'm going to now. You can go ahead and tell me. <laughs> okay. So in the background, I've been listening to just some um, haunting banjo music. Yeah, we didn't have music by the way <laughs> the entire time. Yeah. Yeah, so, oh, so I've just been listening to my own stuff. Uh, it's actually from a guy on YouTube called Space Manager, if you want to look him up. But anyway, while we were listening to that, as the description of the book got more and more intense, the actual banjo music faded out mid-track. Oh, like, oh, <laughs> oh, we're, we're doing this now. Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing. And it literally, like, for the last sentence, it was actual silence. That's... And then it perked back up after okay. it finished. So here's what you're able to parse. Um, the journal itself almost seems to show you information that it wants you to know, not the other way around. Oh. You can tell that the book has been enchanted heavily. Like, there's a lot of like magic like physically emanating off of this object, like you can feel its power as you hold it. Whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, you don't know either. Yeah. <laughs> But, you are able to read the prologue of the book. Okay. Which reads as follows. To all those who muse my writings, I apologize for nothing except for what is to come. If you are to learn my deadly secrets, I apologize in advance because they will bring you nothing but ruin. If you use them yourself, then you are a lot like me. I applaud that. There are things in this universe we were not meant to know as mere mortals. Things that mankind was not supposed to grasp. And yet here I am, holding the reins and screaming for dear life. I pray that you too will choose to discard this book, discard its secrets, and never bother with the awful, horrible truths that I have uncovered. But should you choose to plumb its depths, I salute you. For there is no map in the void. And it is signed as Etsy the Mage. This book is concerning. <laughs> Does she say that out loud? Yes. Like, oh, okay, well, my fine. Man. Wow. I do have this weird superpower where I fuck with Zach specifically through the void of the internet. Valid? <laughs> Fun. I don't know how it happens, but it does. <laughs>